For decades, the idea of being able to simply talk to a device and have it perform tasks for us has been a sci-fi dream. With the advancements in generative language AI, this dream is becoming more feasible. Rabbit, a relatively new player in the AI hardware space, has developed a product called the R1. This small orange device has gained significant attention. With 50,000 pre-orders sold out in just over a week. During demos, Rabbit showed the R1 doing things like ordering pizza delivery just by describing what kind of pizza you want, planning an entire vacation after saying you want to take your family on a trip, summarizing a PDF or web page after taking a picture of it, controlling music playback and navigation in the car. The company claims the R1 can execute tasks across over 1000 apps and services. And using the web portal, you can teach it new skills and link it to more of your accounts. So in many ways, the R1 attempts to act like an actual human assistant that intuitively understands what you need and takes care of the details for you. Rabbit is not the first company to venture into AI hardware. Humane, the first player in the market, attempted to create an AI device called the Humane AI Pin. Despite having the pedigree of ex-Apple engineers, Humane failed to convince anyone of the practicality of their device during a CNBC interview. Their device, more of a philosophical exercise than a practical solution, aimed to replace phones with holographic displays. After raising $200 million in funding, Humane spectacularly imploded just a year later. The company laid off 30% of its staff and ousted its store and other execs. The product still hasn't shipped. It was a sobering reminder of how difficult building a multifunction voice assistant really is. Even Apple, Amazon, and Google haven't come close despite having massive resources. Given the market's littered graveyard of failed voice assistant projects, Rabbit's boasts around the R1's capabilities seemed bold, if not unrealistic. But after researching the company more, I realized Rabbit is taking a very different approach compared to Big Tech or Humane. And I now think they have a real shot at pulling the R1 off successfully. Here are a few key reasons why. Leverage user data. Hybrid AI approach. Thoughtful privacy. Startup scrappy mentality. Focus on utility over philosophy. Of course, the R1 isn't perfect yet. It remains to be seen how seamless it really is for completing complex multi-step tasks. But as an ever-evolving platform, the capabilities will only expand over time.